busy day here in Minneapolis on a Friday afternoon. It's rush hour. But we decided to take a little time to go down to an RV show that's down in the U.S. Bank Stadium, which is where the Vikings play. So we are going down there right now, driving on the freeway here, and we should be there in just a little bit. We're kind of excited to see the newer RVs and see what's out on the market this year. We are in the market for an RV. We're just trying to decide if we want to get a new one or a used one because we sold our little 20-foot Nomad last fall with the intention of having something just a little bit bigger. Uh, the black tank was only nine gallons, so it's kind of hard to go uh, camping for a week. The mm -hmm. number is we have to empty it three times. Right, so we are ready for bigger tanks, a little bit more space, especially with when we take the kitties with us and stuff. It's nice to have a place for their litter box. So we are hoping to find something more conducive to camping at this stage in our lives. Okay, we're here at U.S. Bank Stadium. Yep. And this is the home of the Minnesota Vikings, for those of you out of state. <laughs> but um, we are going to go inside. They're having the Twin Cities RV show, it's called, and go explore, see if they have some new trailers that we're interested in. And check them all out and see which ones we uh, we like. Yeah. And decide from there. So we're going to give you just a little little glimpse here of what's in the area here in Minneapolis. There's a stadium behind us, a snow bank for those of you who live in Florida. <laughs> um, yeah, and there's the downtown area. There's a ship. So, yeah, Viking ship there. So a nice day here yeah, in here Minnesota. For it's like 47 degrees. Nicest oh, nice. day we've had so far this spring. So we're excited yep. that the sun is shining. Yep, that <laughs> helps. Yeah, so we're going to go inside and look around. This one is called the Ember and it's got a little outdoor kitchen, which is kind of cute. Ron and I are both trying to pick our favorite campers today, so we'll see how we do. As we try to limit our decisions on which camper will be our next one. This one's got a Murphy bed, which is kind of cool. Those are really in right now. A little TV. A booth. A little kitchen. Microwave there. No, st no oven, but there is a stove with two burners. And some drawers. Cupboard. Oh! <laughs> You scared me. <laughs> There's Ron. Hey, Ron. So that's cool. It can fit like, like your bikes in there or extra yeah. storage, maybe even a kayak. So they look a little shorter than normal though, these beds. But it's got a fridge. And the bathroom. That's kind of cool. with those shelves there. That's kind of nice. Yeah, a little fan up there. So that's the ember. And 
These are kind of a newer brand, I think. So we were just curious about that, so thought we'd check it out. Oh, oh the teardrops. Yeah, that's cute. There's a hilltop. This is where my dad used to work at. Nice. They look pretty impressive. You know, they they look they're bigger than what you think. Think, you know, from the outside. Yeah. It looks this like the cats a... may fit in here, but no. When once oh, you no. get in here, yeah. it's not that bad. It's got a TV and everything too. Hmm. Pretty comfy. Okay, this is a Nobo trailer, and these are kind of in style right now too. I think they have a lot of like solar and stuff. They're made for boondocking. They don't, they have an induction oven here. Kind of cool round sink. There's all the controls in, in And the a bathroom. cupboard below. And then there's the fridge. And there is Ron. He's going to show us the bathroom. Bathroom. <laughs> Okay, we have you a toilet. put all the controls in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, okay. All the controls are there on the wall. And a little cabinet there above the sink. A round corner shower here. And last but not least, there is a slide out with a sofa on it. So that's kind of nice with cupboards above. So yeah, that is the Nobo. Here, I'll show you the outside a little bit. No boundaries is what it stands for. Yeah, it's kind of a cute little trailer. They've got a bunch of other ones too, different models here. <laughs> Really. I love the red, the retro look. Yeah, I thought so too. So. Very cool. I wish it was like solid wood on the walls. It's just, yeah, you know, yeah. laminate or whatever. Yeah, but. it's laminate. And one thing I noticed on the drawers is. They're pretty. Okay, yep. Yeah, pretty yeah. cheap. Yep. But otherwise, it's really cute. Yeah. You know? Right. Yeah. I'll check out back here. Shower. Beds. You can easily grab the cabinets. Beds. You get out. You have to go to the bathroom. There's cabinets there. Another cabinet. Same size as the other one. Yeah. Walk out now. Bathroom. The shower's on the other side. The privacy.
somewhere else. We're just snooping. <laughs> just snooping, yeah. Hey. This is pretty nice, huh? We can take it to the bedroom. That's pretty cool. Wow. Wash everything. Matter of fact, uh, I, I would use that chair in the bedroom. <laughs> it would work for me, but you'll see. Him. <laughs> Wow. Okay, if you win the lottery, which we don't play the lottery very often, <laughs> if you win the lottery, we'll have to come back and get this. Look at that chair and the fireplace, little desk. How cool is that? Okay, I really like that idea. Nice bed. Mm -hmm. Very cool. And did you get the cupboards over here? Yeah. Uh, Look at all these cupboards. Wow, more of a European look. Yeah, they're really solid. Taller. Nice. Yeah. Oh, this is washer dryer. Washer dryer. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, this one's got everything. Look at the bathroom. And you could live in here, definitely. <laughs> For both nights. Nice bones. Wow. What do you think, Fudi? This one's nice. Yeah. Okay, here's the tent trailers. What a nice, good size. No bathroom. Nice to have a bathroom. Rockwood Premier High Wall. Kind of a tent trailer that's got an area above so you can the bath. Stand it's got a toilet there. in it. Oh, it's got a toilet. A little bathroom. Kind of a combination shower toilet. So this might be good for a family. Not quite what we're looking for, but it's kind of cute. I love that big window. So which one is this? 264 pH. Down sale for 20,000. It's a 22. Oh, okay, 2022.
Oh, this is kind of cute, huh? Yeah. Is this your favorite run? Yeah. This the, so far, this is the favorite one. Yeah. yeah. See, it's got a booth right there. And you got two doors at the bottom. A couple cupboards up there. Cupboards. Bottom room. Big window. Yeah, big window. We got a little radio. Hmm. Two bunk beds. You can either use a storage or oh. got kids. Not bad. Not bad. They're both side up and down and they're Another window down there. Yeah, one window up there. Got a handle. Kids can jump. Oh, out. yeah, that's nice, huh? Yeah. And the bathroom is kind of sinks oh, outside sink. the bathroom. Interesting. Get the sink over here so you can wash your hands. Okay. And then the bathroom's over in here. Get a tub. Nice shower. Yeah, a little fan with a kind Just of a skylight. A test. <laughs> um, <laughs> There's room for your legs. Okay. Yeah, room, a lot of room. So this is Ron's favorite trailer. Okay. Yeah. Oh, it's got a microwave. Nice refrigerator here, stainless steel. I don't know how that opens. Oh, there we go. Pretty nice size. Refrigerator is running. Cold. Ooh. Not a plenty of room. A freezer. Oh yeah. Pretty yeah, good size. Yeah. Okay, now it's got, I think it's three burners three and burners, nice. oven. Oh, yeah. mm. Two drawers, covered underneath. Yeah. Split sink. Three burners, yeah. Yeah, and then it's got oven. kind of a, I don't know what you would call it here, but a pull out couch that turns into a bed. And this flips down for cups. So this sleeps a lot of people. I mean, you could sleep people in the booth as well. And uh, here's the bedroom. Another spot up here, I guess, for a TV if you wanted one. So there's actually room for two TVs in here. And then shelf up there, two cupboards on each side. Nice big nightstand on this side. And then a window here, so nice breeze. Um, could get through there. However, there's not a nightstand on this side. Oh, this, oh, there is. I see. You can move the bed if you want to configure it differently. So, if you move the mattress over a little, then Let's there would be room. Up. Let's see how. Oh, yeah. oh under bed storage. Yeah. This is stove. Yeah, so, okay. so, Ron, you like this one? Yeah, I think. It's Got plenty of room. This is Ron's favorite. And it is wired for solar as well. <sighs> now I'm gonna have to pick my favorite. Hmm. Just got a couch going on. So take it a bit. Oh there, okay. Very cool. Yeah, so this sleeps quite a few people. Just got to get a hold and put it back up. Probably ten people. You could fit in here for sleeping. There it goes. Air conditioning up there. A lot of lights. Yeah. So yeah, it's yeah. a nice trailer. Yeah. This has got actually more than what we need, but yeah. the price is really good on this. Hmm. Use that back for storage. Put in your cabinet. And this is sold at yeah. Hilltop Trailer Sales, right?
Okay, I think I found my favorite. I'm not sure we can afford this, but it's a Rockwood Mini Light. And this is what it looks like. So it's got two doors, two entry doors. There's Ron, relaxing. Oh, um, we do have a sale going on. But yeah, so that's the second steps going up, set of steps to the bedroom area. And it does come with an outdoor grill, griddle. Ladder on the back. So yeah. So this is the bedroom. It's got a really nice closet with drawers and a little cupboard down there. A little hanging space. So you get a huge window there, and then windows on either side of the bed, with cupboards above. What's up? And I think it's a queen size bed here. Missed us. Lift up. Oh, there's a couple drawers underneath here. But yeah, there's storage underneath there. Um, and on the other side of this one, I know there is storage that comes back under the bed from the outside. So this is the bathroom, toilet, and it's kind of a walk-through bathroom. Nice, and nice towel storage in there. With a light and um, a regular door. It opens here. And the corner shower again. Yeah. So cupboards above the sink. And the cupboard below. Nice solid wood. Oops. And then Ron <laughs> found the recliners. There's a slide out here. And light, and light to the occasion. Okay. Nice big refrigerator. Looks like they have the TV set on radio right now. With a fireplace below. Speakers. And then the kitchen. I love this kitchen. Got a microwave. A little kind of a cubby up there. Hood fan. Free burner stove. Oven. Which is a pretty good size, really. Not too bad. Little drawer down there. Cupboards. Oops. Drawers. This size, I think there's four drawers. I love that front window. The double sink. And then the cupboards above as well. And then we have a little pantry here, which is nice. And the pantry on the bottom also goes to an outside little door there. And then when you walk in, there's a big cupboard here that you could also use for a pantry if you wanted to. Or you could take those shelves out and use it for a coat rack. So, yeah, there's some nice space in here. Um, so this would be my favorite. <laughs> it's the Rockwood Mini Light 251-6S. And they are running a sale on it right now. <sighs> so I don't know. We'll have to go home and talk about all this and see what we decide. But we do want to get another camper for the spring summer season coming up. So we're hoping to get something within the next couple weeks actually. Because this is almost the end of March here in Minnesota. So yeah, we're going to look a little bit more here at the RV show, but that's my favorite. Be on the lookout for a new video coming soon where we will have our big reveal of our camper trailer pick. Thanks so much for watching. We really appreciate it. And if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. 
Thanks so much.